Hi everybody, welcome to the channel. Today we will talk about components and how to work on Oxygen 6 and how, how to do this component and the use case that we could use. Uh, remember, if you want to um, receive the next tutorials, you could subscribe uh, to uh, my newsletter on outwp.com and don't miss any tutorial and thank you a lot for subscribing to the channel uh, i'm very happy that you did that uh, so i am ha i'm happy that this tutorial uh, was helpful to to you so uh, let's do it the component uh, what is component okay Oxygen is Builder 6 has a functionality to, to use components um, uh, you can use like global blocks uh, you can do like global blocks to um, do reusable this component and uh, you can you can use uh, to um, to re reuse a part of your website uh, like template but you also can edit the HTML this is the main difference so when you insert this component on a part of uh, of your website you after that you can um, you can edit your 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 content like like this content you know uh, but let me explain a little more so um, it, how wait, what what are the use cases uh, for this component for example if you want uh, to do buttons or or cards or for example heroes too uh, you can do it or header or footer you can do it but maybe this is more for a template directly or for example for menus for links you can you can use this um this element so i i think i believe that the, these um, components are better for um more little uh piece of design uh, than uh, a template a big template that uh, like like header or, or, or footer you know so uh, this uh, a little a little piece of your site that you can reuse for example hero it's a good a good a good thing to do so how to work component uh, we we can we can register component from bot for two sites different uh, from uh, the cpt component on oxygen the the tab of oxygen you can you can register for from there and add a new component register for example i don't know card uh, well we have we have one there i'm gonna trash and trade again post car we will we will do a post car for example a new component and after register works like any post on on wordpress you can edit this component and uh, you you will open a canvas to to style a uh, to start to edit your 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 component right so um, and also we could register uh, directly from from here from your your home for example or for, from your hero or any section that you are working on that uh, you can click right uh, here or here anyway uh, you can save like component for example a hero default for example and save it so we now we have a component so this is this one it's a component so we can save and <clears throat> we can we can edit now this component is working like template you know because we can we can edit uh, the html so uh, you will not see any, um, a lot of different with template because uh, you can, for for this reason you have the template right now for example the header and footer are template so but uh, what is the different on component after registering uh, you need you need go to edit the component to do um, to give uh, the real functionality about component so for example to to convert this a uh, piece of of your website on a content editable you need to uh, go to for example on this text element you need go to there and, and you will see when you hover uh, here you can uh, put a dynamic uh, that data or uh, on this plus you will see that you can edit the and add a property so uh, and here you can uh, put your 
your name for example a uh, content lover for example and uh, this will generate a property key automatically uh, you can you can edit that but uh, anyway you you can use the automatically uh, gen generated from from oxygen 6 so um, we will do that uh, there and we'll put hero um, la uh, heading level for example uh, save it and go to button and uh, this button it's a component so yeah, i needed it to component but uh, this component but uh, let me let me do after but uh, if you see you can put component inside another component this is very nice so and for the image you can use that and go into this plus put this click on this drop down and uh, image level for example image image control I don't know so uh, right now we have this available and uh, we need to edit this button primary save it da, da, da. go to this component and uh, edit that let me change a uh, link a uh, text level and a link button for example saved and i don't know if this will work when when insert this component with another component inside but which going to check so um right now we edit the component we added this component so uh, going to dashboard and uh, we register this component from a uh, with right click right so uh, we need to go to this hero default and our right now i will go to add a new page uh, this component for example publish and i will add uh, I will look for a component element click on choose component here the fall and right now we have this component inserted so uh, if you see uh, you can see for example the heading level that we created and put uh, my heading new for example and this will change and content level uh, it's a uh, text um, rich text so we can put anything my call text i don't know and uh, we can select the image that we can uh, we want to use here and we'll change that so like i suppose that uh, this button <laughs> cannot edit uh, from there so we need to use um we need put to fix that we need to go to the the hero and this not a uh, will be more a component let me change that uh, uh, i will button i will add a uh, sorry text link i wanna put the class that i i've created before and hero button primary like that and i will remove this one and i gonna remove that this one uh, log this utility class and on this component i wanna add right now a text level and for this i wanna put a link button so what i did i removed the another component from there and add a, a button with the utility class that i've created before 
to not do on this tutorial and um, uh, let me upload that and um, right now we have the capability to edit the the component for example here on text level we could change the name to to text level button to to have more sense on the future when one wants edit that let me reload again works faster <laughs> thank god this oxygen six so uh call contact me i don't know put that and we can uh, link uh, to to a page uh, from from there um, and save it save again okay now we have this component ready to to use this is very nice really and uh, this is how to work the component and uh, we can use them um, to do loops on and other things that i will show you when i touch the the topic about dynamic data but this is how to works component um, let me know if it help uh, you uh, that um and, and another video we will talk about um dynamic data so thank you very much subscribe to the channel and let me know anything uh, comment below bye bye